It's on the intro. It's before me. Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Arma. Subscribe, leave, uh, leave a fucking comment, like. Subscribe. Like the video, also don't forget to subscribe and like the video and don't the stuff planned. don't forget to comment if you liked it and yeah oh my god guys just comment the minute you'll be watching this so you can let us know in the comments which minute you're watching oh my god adolf hitler found an armor <laughs> Uh, red team mount up. <laughs> That's a booty. What? Show me that booty, Willa. I will actually fucking kill you, you rat. Um, uh, then we're going towards the next building, so just go towards the road again. Uh, copy on that. the I'll road again. Not to crash. Dun, dun, dun. On the road again. Don't drive backwards, just turn it around. Okay. Go forward and then go right and then you go on yeah, the road. Man. Well, Jarmer can navigate now because I'm with a gun. Yeah, don't just go straight, just go straight through the fucking okay. fence. I'm going right. right to left. Right, right, Copy right. Out. I'm not going to break everything, okay? Calm them down, lads. Christ. Bye bye. Don't drive too fast. And uh, the building is coming up left part behind it, or in right in front of it, on the side of the road, but do not park in front of it, or to the left of it. Just park on the road a bit next to it, so they don't see it. On the left, basically in front of the door. Yo, hold. Here is fine. Getting out again. I'm Turn speed. off the engine. I'm not sure, just take you so little cool. I do not understand a word of what you just said. What? What? We moved up a bit towards the next building and I'll try and fire Hunter R again at the recomposition now. Make sure it's actually a Hunter R this time. Already did. Why are you eating steak at fucking 11 your time? I. Fat cunt. Jarmer, maybe get off the the middle of the road. One a second. Not that much if you're. I know. I'm if you're, uh, make a joke. Ah, oh, little Dan went to make a joke. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Hanson, I will mark the end on the map. Little rat. <laughs> hey, you wanna know a Copy that. joke? You're you live. This button. Hmm? I don't see a button, and you're not going to it fuck. I dub. Not funny. Okay. And you're getting executed again. No. Yes. I'll leave. 
I need to go to sleep. Yeah, you get demoted. Copy. That's how it works. If you leave before Rang your execution. Doesn't really, yeah, Rang doesn't really mean anything. Nobody is listening to me, so. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're Actually, private. That's that's how it works. I'm not a private. Well, you're basically a private. I'm a fucking. Uh, Jerome, take your vehicle and engage from the north side. My vehicle will move in from the south side. Um, copy. You're not a team leader, so no one will listen to you, obviously. Yeah. What? Okay. Ja. Wat is er? Wat wil je nou? Uh, we're going to attack the area from the north, uh, northeast. Um, ja, dat had ik gehoord. Oké, okay, dan niks nog mijn sorry. <laughs> Kun je goed plaatsen of over de? Wat, ik zo, waar, wat wil je nou, joh? Echt geen idee wat je wilt. <laughs> Guide him towards the area so we can start the advance when we need to. Waar toe? Want to uh, maybe mark your, the route you want to take, or? Oh, sorry. It could be in homo. All right then. Yes. We're gonna be moving. Uh... Wait. Oh, we're just driving straight on the road. No, that's the, like what I'm not. I don't know how else. So I would like we need to go from here, like from here, and I have no idea. How maybe else just to go, go around, like around the fortress here on the hill. I mean, around this entirely. Well, if he wants to attack from the northeast, just go like this. Um, uh, but that's not the northeast. That's the northwest. No, this is the northeast. This is northeast. This is northwest. Just start driving, then go left here. Uh, then, uh, uh, sh this is northeast. This. Here. Yeah, this is northeast. Yeah. Yeah, no, it looked like we're there with the mouse thingy. Move towards the area. Go to the forest? No, just go right now. Don't get too close, uh, Tom, by the way. We're not that close. Well, there's a guy standing on the entrance, he can see us if we get too close, so move towards and the go left. And go and a bit more to the forest line. Basically, just go just at the edge Next of the forest thing. line. Just try and go through the forest line, but... I don't know why, why are we attacking with fucking... Vehicles, it's not really. Because there's one Humvee, but still. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense to go into loud ass vehicles when we can just move on. Hanson, um, just go towards the left, he can see us from this position. Uh, we might also go fight the infantry, there's like only one Humvee and three guys. I mean, maybe we can arrest the guy there if we go full on vehicles, there's bound to go for wrong. It's not a good idea to go in with these big ass vehicles. It really isn't. Let's go more right now. I, I don't get this idea. But okay, okay, I'm not entirely sure if I can stay entirely out of its vision. I'll try to go through the force. I don't want to go through the center of the city. I think we. Re I'm gonna say in debrief as well, but we really need to lure, maybe say that we don't move with the vehicles constantly when it's not logical. Don't go too fast. Copy. Old. Overlord, this is Alpha 11. We have spotted some uh, enemies inside, and then Humvee will uh, try and move in. To then I just so said hold. Over. I didn't hear that. We're pretty far away from it now. It's basically it's directly to the east or to the west. Wait, what? No, yeah. south. Never mind. <laughs> okay, in that case. Uh, maybe, guys, scratch, get away from the area. What? Where are we moving now then? Currently it's behind forest, but the problem is the overlord just told us that we need to know who's meeting there. And currently we don't know, and currently we're entirely in the way of who's possible going there. So oh. where do you want us to move? Tell us. I can't do anything with, without... Where are we moving? Hello? Hey, wait a yeah. Yeah, Go towards the forest northeast, like into the forest north. Into? Yeah, into. 
Copy that out. We need to wait for them to meet with the people who are there. Should we scout something? Not right now, we already did, so keep driving and stay in towards the force. So, yeah, I just don't get why I always insist on taking big ass vehicles through the forest. Yeah, this is not my decision. No, it, I'm not directing it to, uh, towards you in specific, but I just mean in general. Why why leaders always want us to take big ass vehicles driving through forests when we want to be stealthy? I just don't don't get it. Hansen, what would be a possibility that we take out the guys and then switch uniforms? Kuch, kuch, because we're both Americans. Wrong channel again. Uh, sorry, uh, wrong channel. Um, we could maybe like take them out and then maybe switch uniforms to see like, hey, we're the same guys. Would be maybe fun, but realistic as well. Then you can alter. here. That's true, but we don't know if we go into lay because I don't have a visual anymore. If like if I can't get close with the vehicle without them spotting me, the vehicle's just too big, too obnoxious to be not visible through the back of the fucking snow. And as we don't have a drone in here, I can't have an eyes on uh, the entire time. The hunter just moves away. What the fuck was that? That's six explosions. Okay, guys, uh, dismount, we're going on foot. Yeah, there's a shit ton of, uh, there's a shit ton of explosions there. Let's go. Do we have any idea what it is? So, we need to check the area from on foot. I, I just asked you something four times. Sorry, I can't hear you when they're talking over the radio. What, what are those explosions? Wacht even. Jesus Christ. Uh, so we're going with my plan or are we waiting for the other guys? I, I, I give that up. Out. Uh, the I explosions are armor. Okay. Let's go. Jesus Christ, communication is horrible today. Yep. Yeah, sorry, here. It's just in July. I sometimes literally have no clue what's going on. Okay, listen up. We need to wait. We're gonna wait till the guys there meet with the guys they're meeting. After which we'll move in. And he says like block any escape routes, but without the like we can go with the vehicle, but we can't get anyone near that without being spotted. Maybe tell them to move their vehicle um, more towards the east, like under uh, maybe put it on the road somewhere here. Like if they drive. All the way over here, they can put it on the road here, perhaps. Or I, I, I don't know. They could move here, but yeah, we don't have enough manpower to do that. No, that's the issue. Let's just move in. I don't know. Uh, Hanson, I'm not able to move the car if we need to. Like, I'm moving with the three guys in the vehicle from towards the ridge line, so I can at least have an eyes on the area, uh, which means I do not have eyes on the vehicle. in the vehicle right now, we're, get it. we're somewhere near the area. Uh, I do not, I can't block the road up if we need to. Guys getting covered, I think, I think they might have seen us. It's uh, currently impossible. I think they might have spotted us or seen the people are moving. Uh, Lucas, move our vehicle up uh, to our position.
Hansen, do you have eyes on, on the uh, meeting point? Over. Moving towards that position now. Moving towards that position now. Yeah, they're moving south. We are being engaged. Let's move in then. Yeah, let's go. Move in, move in. Go, go, go. Move in, move in. Enemies have moved southeast. I think they've met. There's another group. Cars coming in. Cars coming in. I repeat, cars coming. Four times enemy down. And there's a supply truck with people who think of Clear to put a rocket in it? Yeah. Still put a lot of people. Go for it. Lost visual, lost visual. It's literally south, basically. Short. Yeah, I don't have another one. Fucking fire at them, boys. Vehicle 2 is falling back. Germer, we have to fall back. Negative, keep on pushing, keep on pushing. We're getting fucked and here. Copy that, then fall back. Public smoke. I'm moving. Good guys, fall back. I can't go. Just move your fucking head. Dennis down. Go over me. Fucking hell. Go, 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 go. Conquer up. <sighs> Fuck off to say I. Fucking good snipers, man. Flick it up. Yeah. Yeah. Reloading, reloading. This is fucking stupid. Oh, of course you can perfectly hit us through the smoke. Just fuck off. I'm gonna fucking die here. Over again. Do not scroll then, start moving. Move that towards the car, just start running, just to go straight up, move towards the car, do not go prone, let's go, let's go, let's go. I can't fucking run. Not talking to you right now. No, I can. Oh nice, I apparently only have three magazines. Dan, would you mind getting up straight and start Thanks. <sighs> fucking AI. Oh, this is how ridiculous. Get back in the car. Yeah, we're almost there. Uh, at least we're almost, we're almost capable to move there. Uh, we need to wait for somebody getting in the car. And then, what's your status? Old Summer. Did he go down? And Dennis down. 
Right Where is he? Yeah, oh, here. Yeah, just move, move. Flikker even tourniquets op. Ga dan maar. Just cover me. Okay. Niet naar hem kijken. Is ook rijden of niet? Nou, ik ga eerst hem omhoog krijgen. We kunnen niet met twee man de shit aanvallen nu. Nee, maar ze staan, onze vrienden staan op dat gebouw, zeg maar. Ja, nou, dat is jammer voor ze nu, maar... Ze moeten maar even uitzoeken nu. Back. Fuck off. Heb jij nog medical nodig of uh, hou je het vol? Nee, nee, nee. Oké. Okay. Ah, echt? Of we die kant op rijden of niet? Uh, ik weet niet of dat zo'n goed idee is als we nee. nu geen uh, gunner hebben. Echt flikker even serieus op met die fucking sniper AI man. Is serieus, die Pop gewoon een hele s... Ja. Pop een hele move van smoke. We hebben iemand in de machine gun to cover We hebben iemand in de machine gun. Ik ben niet meer te move towards you yet, uh, Hansen. Niet in de machine gun. Oh, je bent de machine gun. Ja, ask her in de machine gun. We hebben even pop een hele muur van smoke. Ik kan zien shit van deze position, just saying. Nope. Dat is nog fucking overhoop gemaaid. Dat is echt niet gezond, dan gooi je echt niet voor de volgende keer. Multiple Hier, contact niet. zelf! Maar ik bedoel zelfs als het fucking gewoon sprayen erin, dan raak je in ons niet zo vaak. Even normaal. Zo gericht ook niet trouwens. Ja, ik werd echt vier keer achter elkaar geraakt. Ik loop de spray als een maniak en ik raak niks. Nee, maar de AI kan overal doorheen zien. Ook leuk dat ik echt bijna allemaal magazijnen kwijt ben geraakt, om een of andere reden. Oké, okay, wordt vol gepompt met C-line. Oh, hij moet een klein beetje split brush omhoog uh, krijgen en dan. Uh... Is hij even stil in de server? Want hij doesn't show up right now. Ja, er zit toch nog een game? Ja, maar, ja, maar je wordt uit dat menu gekikt als je unconscious gaat, volgens mij. Oh, Oké. Okay. Zover ik weet. Zodra die stable is en bloed erin, dan moet je even naar die auto of switchen dan naar de uh, driver seat. Ja, ik flikker er nu even morphine in. En neem een tijd bij meer van even vast voor als je dat zover bent. Ik ga even kijken of ik een appy in uh, Morphine Combo werkt op hem nu. Dan. Dan. Hallo. Oh, Tom just start driving. Wacht even. Oh well, I'll just have to wait. I'm up. Yeah, yeah just there we just go. Keep driving now. Break, break, we're moving towards you now, Hansen. Do I need to know anything right now? Select the situation. Over. Open up moving into 
Jesus in a way. Um, we have possible contact towards the south. Okay, moving towards the south, move towards the south on the hill. What the fuck? I think that's you a dead body you're hitting. No, that's yeah, a that's a dead guy I'm hitting and it fucking launches me. Except it's also here near. Yeah, thanks. I'm gonna get out and see if I can help some medical. Then get in the seat. Yeah, let's do Anyone need some medical? Uh, as probably need some. I'm going to go and see it. What the f fuck? Why, why are you laying down in the gunner seat? What? <laughs> Ass, are you okay? Yes. You're laying prone in the gunner seat. I know. It just bugged out, I guess. gonna stitch you. Need any morphine as well or are you good? Uh, no, I'm fine. Copy. You're stitched. <sighs> Lucas. APC. APC Fuck. where? Directions need some bearings. Copy that. Uh, south. I do not advise one. But yes, south bearing, could you give me a bearing please? Ish 250. Or something along the lines of that. Okay, thanks though, but I have no line of sight of it. It's buying trees now. There's rocket launchers in the cars. Clear back blast on the main gate. You're clear. Clear, clear, clear. Troops incoming west side. Then would you mind moving the truck a bit west? Watch it where you drive that we don't hit the friendlies, do not go to the main gate. Southwest. Yes, watch west. Okay, move southwest, move southwest. I think it's cooking off. Two times enemy down. One more. He's down. Is everyone green? Green. Ben and I are green. Hands the yellow, hands the yellow. Oh, you're getting treated, good. Get back in cover guys, get inside the compound. Shit. Down. Yeah, get inside. Right, Lucas Street Hansen. Okay, killerfish. Killerfish, I got you cover. Everyone, fall back into your vehicles and get the fuck out of here. Gonna give you a quick splint. Yeah. Give killerfish a quick splint and then we're ready. Okay, you're running, uh, Hunter. Okay, give me a Let's go. Go, 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 go. Almost done. Alright, red team back in your vehicle, blue team back in ours. Hold, hold, hold. Well, two. Team red is ready. 
Get the fuck out of there then. Tom got him. Yeah, just get on the back on the road. Or just uh oh, Go around, go around. Go around, okay. So let's let's drive a little. No, where are you going? What? Around the fucking building. He Go means. towards the northwest. Not really. You see that? Yeah. Let's move uh to the road here to the west. Once you're down at the city, go right. Copy. Are you going back to base or what? Yeah. Don't drive too ridiculously uh, fast. Yep. Good. Do not try. Do not drive over corpses. <coughs> Go yeah, right. Nah, yeah. Who cares? Fuck them. They shoot at us. They don't deserve a proper burial. No, I mean otherwise the car gets fucked. Right here. No, just. Uh, yeah. Sorry. I was looking wrong. Uh, now just keep following his road for a little bit. Okay. I'll tell you when we need to turn again. I think our wheels are broken again. Really? Yeah, we're going too slow. What's the color on the wheels? Mm, the good. It says that, but it's too slow. Are you holding shift? Yes. Well, it's just gonna have to do right now. Today well, the biggest issue today with was that I sometimes had no clue what was going on because no one was telling me anything. Like I asked for, I ask what are we doing four times and no one says anything. That was the biggest issue I had today. I think the biggest issue I had today was when me and Jerome went to clear some parts of the city and I was just retarded. Just so I don't understand why you have to take the vehicles literally everywhere, no matter t the terrain. Sometimes we should just go on foot instead of taking these heavy fucking armored vehicles. I'll just take off road. These vehicles you want to next go over. right. What? Okay. No, never mind. I mean, it just doesn't make sense if we have to see watch a meeting that we go in with heavy armored vehicles. We should just go on foot, ditch the vehicle somewhere, go and move on foot and move closer on foot because you can see these things coming from a mile away. Go left to next. Go left here. Next. Left, this is the next. <laughs> um, let's see. Follow the road for a while again. Unless I tell you otherwise. Don't think we're gonna have a turn for a while. Just keep following the road. But yeah, like, we have to fucking check on a meeting. I don't know why, why are we always taking these fucking big ass vehicles through forests and whatever? It just doesn't make sense in my eyes. Should just know when we have to ditch him and just move him foot. Mm. 
That's the big disadvantage of these vehicles than uh, when looking at a Humvee, it's way, way slower. Oh yeah, it's basically a fucking truck with armor plating and a machine gun on top. I know, I know. Doesn't make it any fast. Fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> I didn't have to spend half the mission in a, in a machine gun uh, this time. Right then, the next split, I want you to go right. Even stop ik op een rustplaats langs die eindeloze baan. Hoewel keer ik hier gestopt ben. Ja, al de wet, al de wet, de baan. En de weekends die ik thuis ben zal voor ons het einde zijn. Omdat ik zo lang van huis ben. Next left. Or no, not the next. The harder to road to the left, so not this one. Met de vlam in de pijp scheur ik door de brennerpas. Right now you're taking the next left. Yes. Met de vlam in de pijn scheur ik door de brennerpas. Met mijn dertig tonnen diesel ver van huis, maar in mijn sas. Met de vlam in de pijn door die eindeloze nacht. En dan moet ik even denken aan een vrouw die op me wacht. You feel free coming, bastard. What? No, apparently the other vehicle has to come in his stream somewhere or something. Disgusting. Disgusting communists, you will not enter a US airbase. Can we change? Communism detected on Cherna Russian soil. Lethal force engaged. Do not try and hit the fence this time. 
When you're inside, just go right. Go right here inside and follow the road. Okay, Drift. I'm just parking in the road otherwise. I'll just park inside, yeah, don't worry. Wow, great job. Proud of you. Yep. Strike. Don't worry. I still need to die. I can't run. Doesn't still. matter, just go back towards the debris. It is detecting on American soil. I need to kill myself. Oh, that's, that's it is detecting on American soil. No communism allowed. Communism. I, I, so, I've heard reports of you playing. Communist music. Kill the fish. I want perfection. I think I did kill the fish or Lucas. Any and all red Chinese invaders. Emergency communist acquisition directive. Immediate self destruct. Better dead than red. Better dead than bad. I need to heal. I can see color again. I get a fish. You took my spot. <laughs> <laughs> you took my spot. Rumor. Take back. Do spot. as the man uh, says. Takes ass spots. He's not supposed to be there. No, nope. he's not. No, he's just here. Yeah, he is. Get out of here. Oh, it's so rude. Only leaders at the front. Rumor, just can't take back. Yeah, easy way around, but. Yeah, and I was going to. Yeah. Now he's committed. Well, <laughs> Long way around, you idiot. <laughs> Bone. Bone to bone ass. Good. Uh, and let's start. Uh, everybody here, I guess, yes. So, oh first boy. off, I want to say something. Um, fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you, Jeroma. You fucked up my whole plan. Where? When you fucking spotted that uh, roadblock. <laughs> oh, that's just being good spotting, yeah, boy. Yeah, yeah. For the most of uh, most of the time, I I really hoped you didn't see it. Oh, um, if if Hansen wouldn't have been gone, you wouldn't have seen it because that was the only time where you actually checked over there. I should have gone full me and just sent a jet after on the run. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just destroyed it, simulating that it's, uh, it's uh, got shot. But well, You've good. Lost. I. I don't have a, a map right now, so I can't point, but um, overall, um, yeah, you, you, I, I'm, I'm fairly proud of you. Um, you did pretty well Thanks, today. Daddy. Uh, you did pretty well. Um, you reacted to everything you, you, you encountered um, right, I would say. Um, I've written down some things, let's see. Uh, yeah, basically the first thing I uh, wrote down is when when you were moving from the the, the house where you parked the cars to the other shed. Um, <laughs> for some fun. reason, Jeroma decided to lay down while you were fired upon. Why? Uh, it was more to make sure like I could bit suppress that the other ones could close. But no. in hindsight, that wasn't smart. No, y no, you were engaged by a full no, team. Yeah. Just run. Just run. Try your best to get to cover. That, like that's I basically why the that wasn't smart. yeah, that's why the AI uh, kind of lit you up. <laughs> you, you were super lucky that uh, that smoke was just perfect, hiding you perfectly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, funny. You're welcome. You're welcome about that one. Fuck off with the smoke. Uh, Seriously, like covering me, us. It like shot us he, four uh, times through the smoke. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. You, you, you have to understand that AI shoots through smoke because they know that you were there. Yeah, no, but not with the, the accuracy. The accuracy. Just I mean, they just spray in there. They know where no, you were and then they spray. Uh, that was not well, spray and pray. I have seen 
many times where uh, you were covered by smoke and didn't get shot. That was accurate fire in there. <laughs> that was not spray and pray. Well, however, uh, speaking of smokes, I'm very happy how you used them today. Uh, a lot, which is good. Um, what else? Uh, yeah, when when uh, I think it was Rats as and Hansen were down, I, I liked that uh, Killerfish um, put up a little trench to cover them. It was nice, nice detail. Um, yeah, speaking of Killerfish, um, I know I already heard that somebody will be annoyed, uh, will, will say something. However, Killerfish, since advanced uh, fatigue is on again. Uh, you shouldn't carry that much. Uh, I heard the conversation that uh, Tom said at one point that Killerfish needs an ammo bureau. Pretty much, that's right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like I have four lags with me now. Yeah. We, we need to get you someone to carry that ammo instead of you having to. Yeah, you already have to have a gun <laughs> and all that shit. Yes. Um, what else? What else? Lucas, sit down. Yeah, in general, the cover, uh, the the the, yeah, the the cover I've seen around uh, the 360s and all that that worked most of the time. One or two times it didn't, uh, which nearly got you fucked over. Uh, I, I played a lot of the AI today just just to see how you react. Um, you dealt with me good. You dealt with the other AI good. So I'm happy about that. Um, yeah, on 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 the second part of the task. Yeah, first off, I. When I was writing that, I was not really thinking <laughs> what to write. I just wanted to give you a hint. I didn't thought about the hint. Sorry about the, uh, the confusion there. Um, however, the main reason why I sent quite a, a number of uh, units towards you, I, I planned of having less units coming, um, is because the 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 Kaiman, the one of the MRAPs, was driving so visibly up the hill that I was like, no, that they have seen him and just call in for support. So that's basically what fucked you over there. Because oh I, I, I had this one unit and I was staring at you. I was like, okay, there is... I'm aware. An I, saw him looking at me. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I, I am going to rant about that in a bit. Sure. I, I expected that. Um, what else? Nothing much. Um, yeah, for the first part of the mission, I kind of forgot to uh, drop the AI skills. So I'm happy that you dealt very good with the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the default AI skill. You, you dealt well with that. Good cover. You, you, you got cover whenever you needed. You had uh, lo uh, somebody looking in all directions. Um, very happy with that. And nobody died, which is good, I think. That kind of speaks for you. Um, I mean, the only one who died is Lucas, and that was bullshit. Um, yeah. Okay. That's. I think that's all from me. Um, next one, Sanson. Um. Yeah. Um. It was a good mission, as when he said, there was a lot of good covering today. Um. And I just want to touch upon the uh, the incident where everyone ran across from the vehicles. Um. Why did everyone just run across with no one covering at all? Just pressing fire or anything like that. Just everyone ran across the opening. Um, that was that was a little bit weird. In my like, there was no smoke when you were exiting like the vehicles, and Jerome got down. The first time by the barn, you mean? Yeah, yeah yes. by the barn. Yeah. yeah, I I started running, and then I was like, we should have popped smoke. Yeah, I saw that everyone was running, out, and that's the that's the point where I just spawned in, and I was just like, uh, okay, I'm just gonna pop for two smoke grenades. Yeah, I I was thinking we should have done it when I, while I was running, but I completely forgot about it. And then I, when I got to the barn, I started throwing smokes. So, smokes in the first place, and someone covering. Not everyone running across at the same time. No one was shooting back at all. So, that's the one thing. Um. But other than that, like, uh, I liked how we moved in the forest where we had the red team and, uh, and blue team uh, bounding, basically. Uh, that was kind of cool. I liked that. Um, so overall, I, it was, like, it was pretty good. It wasn't that bad at all. Um, 
Yeah, that's that's all. Actually, one thing is, as when we were moving towards the compound when we got fired upon, like in the second part of the mission, you actually hear what I said. Um. Because I, I was screaming so. at you, going, go more right, go northwest, or wherever the fuck I said. And you just kept running, like, you kept driving towards the main road when we were trying to move on to the main, like, the compound that was the objective. Yeah, I don't think I did hear you. Okay. Were you yelling That's... it over the radio? I was yelling it over the radio as well. Oh, hmm. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, that's uh, that's the only question. I but uh, other than that, fun mission. Suck that I keep fucking crashing, but whatever. Uh, yeah. That's all that I have. As Hansen said, I like the mission. Um, to begin with, I have some issues. I, by the communication with me towards the two team members of mine was not necessarily the today the best, but I, especially in the latter part. But that was also a neat part because I got confused by the hint, like, um, like the, I wasn't entirely sure if they were meeting there, if they were creating the version there. Yeah, yeah I know. That's then with Moon Hansen we discussed and I interpreted it as like we were going to engage in towards the compound and not necessarily waiting for anybody. Which was the reason I was, we were driving relatively close towards them we were like, yeah, it doesn't really matter if they spot us, we're gonna move in anyway. And eventually understood that we like had to wait for any for enemies, so we tried to move away. But I was already quite expecting us to be pulling towards to like to move away too late. Okay, uh, let, me, let me let me let me let me cut you up there. Uh, sorry, I I didn't know that you. Uh, I mean, I did know that you were confused. That's why I popped the task. I hoped you might read the task description, which I can understand that you didn't because you were driving and all. So that that's all on my. I'm, I'm sorry about that. Uh, other than that, I did like the way we moved the smoke curtain at the end where we uh, retreated from attacking that last compound. In my opinion, and uh, Storm's opinion, was a bit ridiculous. I understand that they can just spray. I understand. I returned fire the same way. The way they were shooting us, it was like they were actively shooting near us, like everywhere we went. Not where we were, but like everywhere we went as well. Um... At least it felt like that there. I mean, the, the problem about the smoke is that uh, the wind is very high. Um, I, have, I haven't seen the POV of the uh, units that were shooting you, so I don't know if you, they could see you well, over the smoke. Saw, from the smoke from how we could see it was perfectly closed. Where, do yeah. you mean like when we assaulted the town? No, no, no not the uh, town, the like the point. recon point. Uh, you, you couldn't see what, what they meant. I, I know what okay. you meant. Uh, however, I kind of expected that that was a it bullshit there, that's why I constantly gave you full heal. Yeah, but thanks for that. And otherwise, another thing then, if you try to clear a compound or an area, I told you Wednesday as well, move way slower. You're moving way too fast for you to see anything at all. Which was like, one of the reasons why the guy you saw uh, spotted you and started firing at you, where you were like, moving like an ADHD patient up speed. Um, no, <laughs> no, but like, I tried to shoot him and you kept moving left, right, up, down, and like, do you want me to shoot you through the head there, or what were you th and just, like, if you see something like that, if you're in the open, you probably won't be in time away from him to shoot you, so then if, as in this case, I was your body, just scream like, get uh, somebody bearing where you were looking, so I know it's there, I can respond, I'll take it out, and you go down, flattering your face, or you just like, uh, stay where you were, and don't move the fuck, because if I need to compensate for that, taking that guy out, and making sure you, I don't hit you while you're moving all around in my firing line, I will eventually probably hit you. In this case, it went off without like uh, me hitting you, but next time just stand still or try and return fire yourself, but don't move like a maniac around that. Same when for the second guy we got, you were moving way too fast for you to actively spot him and take care of that situation. If you clear something like that, speed is key, I know that. But to a certain point, you need to move slow enough to make sure you can see the actual guy or people you're looking for. Do you understand what I mean? Yeah, yeah, I got that. Okay, then I don't really have anything to say except that the communication between me, Tom and Dan, which was also kind of my fault. I wasn't relaying, especially in the end, not enough information towards them. So, Tom? <laughs> yeah, um... For the most part, the mission uh, was, went pretty well. Um, I think uh, at least uh, 
the way we moved in the beginning, uh, from cover to cover, just going up the hill, covering each other with the teams was pretty good. I like that everyone finally starts using smoke. It's very important that we uh, keep using it because it, it really helps us moving uh, across open spaces. So everyone make sure you always bring enough smokes with you. I as a medic always take like at least 10 to 12 smoke grenades with me. So just make sure you have a, a nice supply in your back. Um, yeah, the communication was pretty bad at some points because I, I sometimes had no fucking clue what was going on while I, while I had to navigate then. But, well, Germ already touched on that, so I'm not going to go rant about that. The one thing I do really want to point out, though, is that we really, really need to start learning when we need to leave the vehicles behind. Because at the end, it's, I, I really did not understand the decision of taking both vehicles, which are heavily heavily armored, armed vehicles. They're, they're fucking heavy. And you're not going to go driving them through force when you want to eavesdrop on some meeting. Cause it, as Mooney already said, you could see that thing from miles away, which I already told Jerome, like, why are we not just ditching it and moving on foot? Yeah, I, I, I want to say something about that as well. Uh, totally Tom's uh, opinion here. Uh, I have no idea why you brought that uh, thing up. Um, the, the, uh, the, the, the Husky was a good idea to bring it uh, from, from that side, but uh, since you came from below, it doesn't really make sense to move up with the car. Uh, I mean, I'm at this point was very, very, very astonished that the husky is not destroyed. It, when when shit hit the fan, the the husky was surrounded by enemies. So pretty happy that this didn't get destroyed. But uh, you could have moved from from the building where you were holding uh, the last time where you shot uh, Hunt IR, um, and then move up by foot. Probably better. Tom is right there. One more thing to say, uh, I like the fact that I used the Hunter uh, today a bit more. It gives, especially with the when we were approaching the first city, it gave me like confirmation that the vehicles weren't there. Like, you know a bit more about the layout of the area and where people are. And, uh, uh, yeah, a little, little tip about that. Um, try to figure out where the wind is going. Uh, yeah. I, I found out uh, the hard way that the Hunter uh, just flies away because since it's winter, it's, it's fairly windy and you kind of need to accommodate for that. I noticed, and sorry for firing an actual grenade round instead of the hunter over there. That's okay, as I said, I was kind of kind of happy about your place late today, so I, I was like, yeah, yeah, no. Also, I didn't have a backup plan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but yeah, that's, that's all for that, really. Just that we really need to start assessing whether it's, it's a smart idea to bring heavy vehicles somewhere. It's, you can't just plow them through any fortress like it's the fucking Ardennes in 1940. <laughs> That's true. Um, yeah, for the rest, I, I don't really have any big things to remark. So next. Get a fish, yeah. Get a fish done. Hmm? You're up. What do you want to say about the mission? Nah, uh, I should <laughs> probably lose some weight. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. yes, you should. You can select an ammo slave before the next mission. Yeah. Okay. Just try to find somebody who doesn't have a good assignment, and a useful assignment, and then that's your ammo slave. Yeah. Just basically use the new guys as ammo <laughs> slaves. Yeah, I know. No, this as long will as come down to medic it. or marksman. Yeah, yeah, not, yeah but not new guys won't be medics right. or marksmen, so hey. Well, Lucas is a new guy and he's a medic, so. Yeah, but medics. Yeah, but he has to train. Are... So. Yeah, okay, but just find someone that's just a rifleman and just tell them, carry some ammo for me. Yeah. Medics are untouchable, simple as that. Wait is. <laughs> okay then, uh Lucas. Uh first off, uh Dan. Fuck out of my face when I'm covering a site. <laughs> because at the barn I was uh, covering one side and then just took right in my fucking rifle barrel. <laughs> face. Yeah. People have this get oh, no, some awareness that. of where they're positioning themselves. Lucas, yeah, I oh, even told him, like, no, I'm covering this side, and just... Uh, the, however, then in general, I don't know if you've noticed uh, yesterday, um, that whenever I crossed your line of fire, I was uh, saying crossing, 
which means I'm crossing your line of sight. Um, just just try to get used to that. Uh, when, when you cross in front of somebody, when you try, uh, when you will stand in front of somebody, I don't know. Just tell them that you are in in their way right now, because. It just has to happen that he, in the moment you are trying to move there, sees somebody, starts shooting, he pops your head, and then, yeah. Just try okay, to get used to it. Let yep. me just explain myself. Lucas, I looked right at you, I said over radio, Lucas, I'm coming over to your side. You said nothing. So I just moved. Yeah, but behind me, not barrel. Yeah, if possible, always go behind somebody. Yeah, okay. I, I don't know what happened there. Then one more thing about walking front a uh, killer fish at the forest when we were moving like into t uh you said crossing, but you could have easily walked behind me. Yeah, but I was walking so slow so I I walked uh walked straight to the area I was meant to be. <laughs> so as long as she's just crossing, it's I, fine, I, it doesn't really matter. I, I didn't want to go any detours when I was Killer moving in. the tank. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking me. One mile per hour. Okay. Uh, then the formations we need to look at. Because at uh, the forest, someone said. Started walking That's behind each other. When we were in the forest. Uh, someone said line formation. Started walking behind each other. Not next to each other. I I think it was quite a line, at least from what was I saw. Yeah, line. but at the uh, beginning you mean we, when you're we moving had... up to the roadblock. No, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Some people first started walking behind each other. Oh, I, I mean that was when they were getting into position. As I saw, at least from my HUD, I could see that most people were actually fanning out and yeah. making a line. One we were moving. Also, relative line, and especially it, it with the mortar coming in, you can't, you just, eventually, we just say, we need to move. You can't stay there, and if it's a perfect line. And with people moving with different loads, the game doesn't allow you to move at the exact same speed. So eventually, people will get behind each other. Just, just keep in mind, that when it comes to formation, form follows function. Yep. It doesn't and need to be a perfect line, it just needs to resemble a line. It's just so that you don't run into each other's crossfire, basically. Like that we don't you move in a big, column as well. You have a big base of fire you can uh, shoot from, so everyone can basically shoot at the targets instead of uh, only one being able to fire and the rest running behind them. Just make sure you keep enough spread, you don't need to be on, as Muni said, on the exact same line. It's never this gonna is... happen. This is something that happens sometimes, um, that um, people are very, very distracted by the fact that they need to hold a perfect line. Just don't look left or right, um, just just move straight. When you know that everybody's moving, move straight and you know that this should be a line. If you're using SD HUD, you should be able to fucking see it anyway, so... Yes. Even them, uh, we don't normally follow a straight line, so... No, I mean, it's not gonna be a, li a straight line anyway, because there's there's ob obviously obstacles that you need to go around, trees and stuff like that. Yeah. So it's always gonna be a little bit, like, wavy. But as long as you keep it so that you're not inside the other person's line of fire, that's the most important thing. As long as everyone's able to move forward, and their cone of fire is not obstructed by a friendly, that's the most important thing about the line. And... In the middle of there, I also said, you know, move cover to cover instead. So I basically broke up the line formation. And, you know, so so since we were taking fire, so that everyone got in cover and stuff like that, and still had the cone of fire opportunity to engage the enemy. Just one more addition to the whole uh, formation thing, especially with a, with a wedge V line or something like that, uh, for the leaders. Maybe um, tell the people, or whoever calls out the formation, tell the people what speed they should go. Because I, I've seen that in, uh, when you were moving towards the roadblock, I think it was Tom, Killerfish and somebody else, don't know who. Um, that Killerfish was walking, but the, others, the other two were walking quicker <laughs> yeah that's uh, because of the weight no but yeah of, of course but then then just try to accommodate with the slowest part um as i said just try to to tell the people what speed they should go because it, it's good if you have a line formation that if some uh, if you want them to walk go slow 
that everybody goes slow. <laughs> I've seen that a lot, that, that people just have different speeds. Good, that's all for me. Uh, and... What? Yeah, what? he drove back into me. Your mic is cutting out all the time. Like Hansen, you drove into me with uh, the vehicle. Uh, the oh. vehicle, the vehicle. I was driving forward, and then the vehicle lagged out, and it glitched backwards. It, it lagged and then out it, before already. It so. lagged out before I was able to do anything. I basically I pressed W, it started lagging out. It slammed back into the fucking wall, and then it like flipped over. It was a pretty funny sight. I was a unit when it first flipped. I was walking up to you, and then I just see the car flying away, and I was like, "Okay." <laughs> yeah. By the way, were you the guy that ran, like, walked in slowly towards the compound and it just blasted you around from around the corner? Yes. Like, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, uh, you were probably the American running in as well. Yeah, that's one. That's the one I mean. Like the American yeah, yeah, exactly. running in. I uh, just see him around the corner and just blasted him. Yeah, I knew that you were there, and I I wanted to know if the others covered the entrance since you were not looking at the entrance at that point. Somebody did, so yes. Yeah, that yes, was me. I, I was going no, back. No, somebody else was shooting as well. Oh, okay. Yeah, it was me on the... On the... Oh, okay, okay. okay. I, 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 I was a lot of units today. <laughs> I had my fun. Good. Um, Lucas, done? Yeah. Yeah, then Dan? Uh, first of all, I really got annoyed when I was driving and Tom says something and Jerome said... Jerome says something else. I guess that's the communication problem, but yeah. And I think for the part when we were behind the barn and our vehicles were broken uh, okay. after the peace break, I was covering I think Northwest and someone just said Lucas go cover Northwest. I, I really don't have an idea why, you know, why would he cover, why would two people cover one side? I think when yeah. when the vehicles were getting repaired, no one was really focused at that point. It was everyone was taking no, a it short was break. No, 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 I know what he meant. I said I made them switch the, their directions because they were in better cover when looking in different way. So I gave certain people the I switched two people around. I think I switched Dan and Lucas around there. Okay. Made us look like yeah, at the yeah, I get your I get your point about the communication of vehicles. When when we assign a navigator, only that person should. Talk yeah. about directions and the other, like if there's a gunner, you shouldn't start screaming for that. Uh, I like him. So that's a fair point. Yeah, the thing is, Nick, the AI, it was too much of a snipers. Oh. I got totally to destroyed. Yep. I yeah, but as, as I said, today the AI was a fairly high set um, because I forgot to yeah. make them lower. But I did it uh, in, in the last part. However, um, you did very well. Like for yes. for the for the fact that they were quite precise, uh, you you took the, your covers as I wanted it to, and as I said, I'm very happy with that. Okay. What? Bye, Lucas. Bye. No, oh, whenever he leaves, they ever when he jumps out. Why did I just fucking die? Oh. <laughs> I have okay. No idea. Bleeding Wasn't maybe, me? and didn't go to the basement. No. Was it going grey? I ask you to heal me. You can go to the base medic. Boom. Oh my god. <laughs> but uh, let's finish the deep. Okay, then, then anything else to say? No, 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 I'm good. Okay, then Ass. Red says. Ass. Ass, respond. You have time to shine. Oh. <laughs> I've got nothing to say. Oh, who okay. uh, was videos. getting killed today? I already set up a nice thing, so I want someone to die. Um... Uh... He hasn't been no. killed. Yeah, he hasn't Mooney been killed. For Mooney in the yeah, part yeah, part yeah. So. I, I, I don't. No, I don't deserve it. Why? No, why? I don't Tell care. But you Everybody haven't been killed does. in a while. So yeah, just, and why? We just need someone well, to die. Yeah, then well, kill somebody. It? Yeah. Yeah, but we, we you're German. <laughs> That's the reason. Okay. That's a good enough <laughs> excuse for me. He's to on the honest. airfield. On the airfield at the cannon. On the airfield. To the right. Yeah. Are you blind? Yes. Sorry, Mooney, but it's one of us. The biggest problem is I. What I see is. <laughs> I know my game, it might crash while, so... Hey, no just problem. saying. Yeah, but... Uh. Who cares? I someone escorted him to the fucking thing. No, no I don't... Escort. You can do it, you're escorted. Okay, okay. Don't shoot then, guys. <laughs> don't be cunts. <laughs> <laughs> no, killer fish, no. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking bastards. Oh. No, come on. Be nice. Tough one. Oh, okay. It's gonna be a tough one.
Does Mooney have a big stomach, eh? Yeah, yeah it's getting quite fat, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, fat little bastard. Well, I know that the killerfish tries Nazi. to, but... Uh, fucking faggot. Tom no, is talking about him. Well, you know that, right? <laughs> uh, to him. What? So, can I say something? Yeah. Wait! Oh, Japan, what the fuck so. have I done? Oh. Oh. You... What the fuck was that? I folded my gun and I couldn't fire. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. Okay, Alright guys, do an outro. You we fucking No, a good outro. Subscribe, bitch. Money, give me an outro. Fuck you. Ah. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> like, subscribe, don't forget Go to fuck comment yourself. down below. And kill yourself, you, you fucking faggots. <laughs>